One of our most frequently asked questions of renters is what does it mean that when the sensors are just dangling and they're not attached to the head and you start a neurofeedback session and you still hear the interruptions in the music, does that mean that the program isn't working? So that question is a good one. And it speaks to the bigger question, which is how does the neurofeedback system work in terms of gathering electrical information from the head and then creating those interrupts? So when the sensors are attached to your head, it's collecting the electrical activity that's on the surface of the head and it's sent to software that reads those electrical patterns looking for shifts in duration, intensity, and frequency. And when it picks up on a certain electrical dance, let's say, it interrupts the music. And that interrupt is a cue for your central nervous system to pay attention. And so what is it paying attention to? It's paying attention to two data points, what's happening externally in the environment, as well as what's happening internally, what it's doing with its electrical communication. So when the sensors are attached to the head and the interrupts happen, the cue is meaningful to your brain because it sees something meaningful, which is that it's about to perform an action internally. And it compares that with the environmental needs. When you have the sensors just dangling and you start a session, these are collecting all the electrical activity that's in the environment. And some of that electri electrical activity is going to be cause for the system to create those interruptions. However, when you're listening to those, it's not meaningful because it's not the EEG activity of your head. So when you hear those, it's not a meaningful communication because your brain isn't about to do something. So you needn't worry. It doesn't mean that the program isn't working. It just means that the sensors are passively collecting information from the environment. And sometimes that electrical information is going to be read by the system as a reason to create an interrupt. But that interrupt, again, is not going to be meaningful for your particular brain in your brain training.